This is LiveWeb version 1.4 and there are two exciting things I want to talk about. First is Inbox Server and second is LiveWeb Play. Inbox Server is a brand new feature that allows you to import videos directly into your video queue from any device in your network. Enable Inbox Server in Settings. Now you can scan the QR code or long press it to share or copy the URL. You can either use the IP address of the device or the clear name shown above the QR code. Once opened on any browser in your network, you are able to upload, rename and delete videos. A new inbox section gets generated containing all new videos. The inbox section in LiveApp and the browser interface are mirrored, so if you change something in one, it will change in the other. You can play videos directly from the inbox section or drag and drop them into a new section. By default, new videos get imported as skipped. This way they get ignored by autoplay and don't interrupt your live productions. This can be changed in settings setting up loop for the inbox section and then managing the playlist through inbox server remotely could be a great setup for some situations. We think inbox server is a great time saver for productions, especially if you're using a mix of operating systems. The second thing I want to talk about is LiveApp Play. LiveApp Play is a new version of LiveApp that focuses on video playback. It has two familiar tabs, video queue and settings. And it also contains everything connected to video queue. So there's autoplay and ATEM switcher communication. And there's also the new inbox server built-in. You get all of this for a more affordable price. Live at Play is available also for iPad and Mac, but it's also available for iPhone. This can turn your old iPhone into a really powerful video playback machine. We updated our website and documentations, but if you have any questions, please feel free and contact us.